Hello world, lock picking dev. Today I have a multi-lock interactive with serrated drivers. This is a brown belt lock. I have only picked this once and I love my multi-locks so um, let's have a go at it. We gotta just wiggle it up, make sure that we know it's all reset and uh, let's go. Uh, pin one outer. Go. Pin two. Pin three. Switch picks here. Okay, I wanted to check that pen too there because I can almost visually see it look like something was sticking. Yeah, let's switch to a little bit longer. Without getting our pick stuck in there. Feeling like pin two needs to go up more, but I think we are good there. I think it's my thumb pick here sliding off. So I'm gonna get a a full flag here. Yeah, pin two seems fine. Pin five possibly. Click out of it. There's four. Like another one on three. Some good rotation here. Not quite there yet though. I think we're in the back here on four. There we go. There's four.
go pin 5. We got under pin 5 there. Felt some movement there now. Now we're moving forward. Pin 2. There we go. The inner on 2 is set. The inner on 1 is set. It's pin five again. Now one, two, looks like it need to go up again. Let's make sure we're at a, the right angle here. Uh -oh. I just overset one, I can see it. There we go, big turn, all right. So now we're almost there. So I must need to hit two just right. And I think it's back here. Five, there's our open. All right, so now get everything out of the way here, get a real mat because I don't want it going everywhere. And here is our key. So for anybody that's interested right now, there's our key. Lots of highs, really low in the back. And, um, all right, let's, uh, let's try to gut this damn thing. Oh, sorry about that. So I do know that in the back here, the cam's a little messed up. Oh, okay, make sure we're not changing that. The cam is a little messed up. The, uh, the detent came out where the spring was from the uh, previous person that gutted it. So I guess something happened there. So I'm going to try to. There we go. Got that out. Okay, so yeah, that's what, what happened. It came out of that spring spot right there. So there's a broken spring in there, which might make this easier. We'll just have to replace it all or the spring when we're done. Set it. I think I did. Oh, no, there we go. I'll keep it turned. Okay, so that is directly attached to the core. So then we'll put that there and try to pull it off this way. Yep, reset the core. That's great. Oh well. Just get the dang C clip off. That'd be fantastic. Unfortunately, this doesn't fit in there. Um, Still on camera here. <laughs> Still in view. There we go. 
go. Got it coming off a little bit there. Let's see if I can get a pair of needle nose and pull it off. Damn it. <sighs> Clip back on. Well, if all this fails, I can fast forward through this part. Don't really have a choice here. There we go. Holy cow. Okay. C clip off. Finally. About time. Alright, so now we're going to need the key because we did reset it through all that. Gotta pull the core out a little bit. It should. So damn nervous. There we go. And that's why, because I already had. Something dropped down. So let's see if it'll continue coming out or not. Yep. Sure as shit. There we go. Okay. So I'm back in. I'll turn it. In fact, let's do a roundabout. Okay, well, there's all of our drivers, because it's not that important with the drivers. I just want to keep our key pins straight here. side holes on there too and the key is stuck now which I'll figure that out here shortly it has to do with the interactive I don't know but here is our drivers last one there Zoom in on that. And see if there's a way I can get it closer to the camera. And 
here we are. So you can see we have our serrated driver pins up there and our key pins down here. And this was a multi-lock interactive with serrated pins in it. Alright, I wasn't being the smartest, so yeah, the reason why I couldn't pull the key out is because of the interactive pin right there. So if you look at it, see it stops right there, so we can't pull it out. Put a screwdriver in there. Push it down. There we go, it'll come out. And the reason being is because the that little, you can see that notch right there, glowing silver, it's a little pin that pushes up in the bottom there to push that interactive pin up. So yeah, there we go. Alright everyone, thanks for watching.